What's going on everybody? Andrew here. Got another pod review for you of the Trinidad Scorpion. This is one of the chilies I got from Pepper Ridge Farms. And as you can see, it's got a nice little gnarly tail there. Um, it's a decent sized pod. It's fairly smooth. Got some good bumps and ridges and all sorts of crazy stuff going on there. Uh, these are currently on for sale. Um, these are for sale at uh, pepperrichfarms.com. You can also get them <coughs> just email rob at pepperrich.com. That's the email address to uh, go ahead and order uh, these. And then you can pre order all the other pods they have. Um, and then if you go to the website, they'll show you what they have available to order down the road. This one. As you can see, is pretty packed with Bacenta. The Trinidad Scorpion obviously originates from Trinidad. It's a Trinens chili, and it's I mean, there's a good deal of. Let's see if I can get that there. You can see the the redness on the knife there. That's why I like to use the white ceramic braid because it really gives you the opportunity to see. Um, see the uh, capsaicin. I'll try and get some of this these seeds out. This thing is a pack. So I'm of just trying to get as much out as I can. I'm not going to get everything out. Um, you can buy these chilies by the half pound, by the pound. Um, then they do um, one to ten pounds. There's a, there's a price for that, and then you can do ten to ten to fifty pounds, and then fifty plus. So um, there's a good deal of placenta in here. And just so y'all know, I'm not removing any. I'm just getting some of those seeds out so this is a Trinidad Scorpion from Pepper Ridge Farms cheers Ah, uh, fruity, tangy. I guess most seeds, there's a bunch of seeds in there. Um, so right away, it's got a pretty good mouth burn. Um, starting to build a little bit. Um, this time I actually brought my rag and my spit cup. I chose a Redskin skip spit cup. I'm originally from Northern Virginia. Uh, right outside of Washington DC so no matter where I live I'm gonna root for the Redskins so um, when I was out there this weekend they had he, I mean the scorpion plants were just loaded with chilies um, the scorpion pepper can range anywhere um, from the five to six hundred thousand range to any or over two million, depending on the the variety of scorpion. Um, the most uh, most prevalent varieties are probably the Butch T, um, who was which was originally designed and grown by Butch Taylor, um, and then then the Maruga variety of the Trinidad scorpion. Um, both of which are known for being much much hotter um, than the, just the standard variety of Trinidad scorpion. 
Um, the Butch Taylor, Butch T uh, ranges in the 1.5, and then the Maruga can go up to 2 million, um, depending on the plant. Um, it can vary um, by plant as well. Um, this chili um, has a very high heat, uh, the specific one, um, but it's not overwhelmingly hot. Um, it's definitely manageable. It's a flavorful and tasty chili. Um, you can still taste some of the um, the tart fruitiness of the chili itself. Um, it didn't have any of uh, any of a, a bitter flavor um, that you can uh, get with some of the ultra hots. Um, um, but it's still very very hot. Uh, when he when, when you order them I mean you're gonna get them by the half pound or pound or you can get uh, pricing based on that to check on uh, the 2013 grow list uh, you'll want to go to uh, pepperrich.com and uh, there he shows all of the chilies he's growing um, if you just go to um, I think it's pricing information tab you can uh, f find out what the what the deal is there um, so either I think I'm getting used to these chilies um, and my stomach is getting used to it because I felt the hiccup coming but I, I just I guess it never came um, I still have some stopped in my teeth um, but this chili's got an overall all-around mouth burn um, it's fairly hot <clears throat> I'd probably give it a 7 out of 10 on heat um, Got a good bit of spit going, but I think it's hit its peak. Um, so if you wanna, if you wanna get the uh, Trinidad Scorpion chili, um, go to uh, pepperrich.com, or you can like us on, like Pepperrich on Facebook at Pepperrich Farms. Um, and then if you wanna pre-order any of his other chilies, um, you can do that by uh, sending them an email to rob at pepperrich.com with uh, the quantity of chilies you wanted um, and then the variety. Um, I know he's going to have Trinidad Scorpions, Trinidad Maruga Scorpions, um, some pot brain strains, of which I did a review of already, and that thing was brutal. Um, and, uh, those will be, I believe he's shipping those out next week. Um, but you'll have to check out his website to get more information. You can go ahead and pre-order them. Uh, those are very hot. Um, he's got, uh, seven pot, uh, brown or chocolate seven pots and a bunch of other varieties. I believe he's got Buchalokis as well at some point. Um, the heat's still climbing a little bit from what I can tell. Um, it seems to be moving towards the back of the mouth a little bit as I talk um, and as the saliva starts to carry it around. Um, but all overall, it's a beautiful tasting chili. Um, it's very characteristic of that scorpion flavor. Um, and you can pick them up over at pepperrich.com, rob at pepperrich.com, or like on Facebook for Pepperidge Farms. So, um, thanks for watching, guys. As always, share the video, uh, like it, favorite, comment, tell me what you think, and I'll see you on the next review. Thanks. Have a good night.